Uh, we have a crime alert out of Pritchard tonight. Before noon today, Pritchard and Mobile police responded to Berkeley Avenue. According to police, one person was shot. At this time, police have not released the identity of the person who was shot or what the cause for the shooting was. NBC 15's Karis Harmon joins us now. Karis, police also have not released the condition of the victim. No, they haven't, Kim. Many people left wondering exactly what happened. However, one thing that people in the Trinity Gardens community are sure about is that the violence needs to stop. Trinity Garden is a very family, family neighborhood. I'm, I'm from here. Uh, I just wish these young young guys to put these bullets down. Before noon Tuesday, Pritchard police responded to a scene on Berkeley Avenue, responding to shots fired. According to Mobile Police, one person was shot and was taken to the hospital by a personal vehicle. Right now, that's all we know because Pritchard officials refuse to give us any additional information about the shooting. Brandon Butler, a member of the Trinity Gardens community, tells me the violence inside of the area is getting worse. Uh, when I was kids, we used to play running out, run around these streets. Now, bullets flying. The shooting happened on the same street where there are two churches, Trinity Lutheran Church and Mount Hebron Church Ministries. And the shooting was about a block away from Chastang Middle School was very alarming just because of what just happened in Nashville on uh, yesterday and then this today. Barbara Davis works at Mount Hebron. She says she heard the gunshots and they had to lock down the daycare inside of the church as a result. Just sound like firecrackers. And is that something that happens often in this area? In this area, yes it is. Davis says 10 years ago they kept the doors of the church unlocked. That's not the case anymore. We keep our doors locked and it's a safety factor because we have to keep the children safe. The parents want to know that their children are safe. We can do this together. We can do this. We can live among each other and still be able to take care of one another and not kill each other. Coming up tonight at 6, a potential partnership between the city of Pritchard and law enforcement to stop violent crime. Kim?